and today I'm gonna be doing a jeans collection which is basically me trying on every single pair of jeans that I own which is many <laughs> I feel like jeans are such a staple in your closet and you can never really have too many pairs of jeans if they're all different and if they all have like a different style cut color rips in the knees like if they're all just a little bit different I feel like I can wear all of them and switch out my outfits a lot and some of these are less expensive and some of them are more expensive so I kind of wanted to give you guys some ideas on what brands of jeans that I like and what are some inexpensive brands that you guys can buy some good quality jeans from I have two categories of jeans one are like the tight jeans and then one are kind of like the looser ones and those can include mom jeans and flare jeans straight jeans and then the tight fitting ones are just basically skinny jeans some of them have rips they have different washes and different colors so I'm going to haul every single one that I have from both categories and show you guys which ones are my favorites so the first one is just your regular pair of black jeans um, these do not have rips in the knees they are from Topshop and these were an investment so I got this when there was like a deal for buy two get them buy one buy one get the other one buy one get one half off so I got this as my first pair of just regular black jeans Topshop does have petite jeans I can't remember if these were petite or they were just a really small size but these are the Jamie jeans they cut off at the right length which you guys know I am super super short so it's really hard to find jeans that cut off at my ankles and I think it's just a must for everyone to have black jeans that are not ripped in their closet so as I said there was a buy one get one half off deal so at the same time I got another pair of jeans I just got a a regular denim medium blue pair of jeans this is like the most regular blue color ever because I noticed that all of my other jeans were very very like saturated blue like they were bright blue this is the Jamie style again my favorite style from Topshop they cut off right at the ankle and they're high-waisted and the Jamie jeans for me are super super flattering and I just love both of them so these were an investment and they're really great quality so I would definitely suggest Topshop but there are also some other ones in here that are less expensive next I have a cheaper pair of jeans actually very cheap these were like $25 or something maybe even less they are these very very ripped pair of jeans from blue notes and they are high-waisted really stretchy which I like sometimes but sometimes I don't but these are so comfortable they feel like you're wearing leggings I've had them for a long time so they're a little bit faded like the colors getting faded but that's just because it's not the greatest quality but I would definitely suggest blue notes for jeans if you haven't tried them next I have my current favorite pair of jeans these are from um, Topshop once again Topshop please sponsor me these are super high-waisted which if you have short legs then it will give the illusion of longer legs it has one two three four five buttons going up I've gotten so many compliments on these jeans because it just makes the outfit a little bit different these are the petite ones and they cut off at the exact right length so these are definitely my favorite now I have a pair of looser jeans these are some mom jeans that I got from Princess Polly a long time ago the brand is the a brand jeans and they're light wash I had to roll them at the bottom because they were too long but actually usually people roll mom jeans anyways so I feel like that's a normal thing to do I really like the back pocket triangle thing I just am obsessed with that for some reason when jeans have that I just love it like I know that guest jeans have that too the waist is a little bit big for me so I usually have to wear a belt with this but that's actually no problem because I have some pretty cute belts that I like to accessorize with Princess Polly does have pretty expensive jeans so I don't know if you guys want to take the risk of ordering it online but I am 5'1 ish and I have really short legs and these kind of fit me so if you guys are around the same size as me I would suggest just trying them out because I think you can just return them if they don't fit then I have these jeans which I recently put in a recent video and it was with my thread up haul kind of video link up there if you want to see it it's about saving the environment but these are Madewell jeans that I got for a super discounted price from thread up and Madewell is such a nice brand they are made well these fit me so well which is weird because when I order jeans online they rarely ever fit for some reason these are really flattering on me and I don't really know why but I just love wearing them so black jeans with rips is super cute for especially fall outfits so this is another staple that I love having these next jeans are kind of funky and I know that I have not worn them a ton but I feel like if I had the confidence to wear them I probably should I got these in LA when I went to the gifting event and these are 
are from Madewell again. There are these lilac flare jeans and I'm still kind of getting used to the flare trend. I'm really trying to just go out of my comfort zone and wear these so maybe I'll wear them soon but these are super high waisted and so freaking flattering. Obviously they're really great quality. This is a more expensive pair but the color is so unique. I feel like I can make a really cool outfit with this. I just have to get the confidence to do it. I have a pair of straight leg jeans which I think is really nice to have because you see mom jeans a lot and then you see skinny jeans a lot but you don't really see straight jeans and these are really nice I feel like with heels or heeled boots. These are from Guess and Guess is one of my favorite brands ever. They also have the little triangle on the back which I love. These are mid-rise which I don't usually go for but I wanted to try something different. It's like a raw edge at the bottom which I don't have any of I think. This is the only pair with the raw edge. Also they have a rose gold button which is Kind of cool. I have a pair of skinny jeans here. These are from Hollister and I got these on sale so they're about like $20. We all know Hollister is kind of known for their jeans. I personally have never been able to fit in Hollister jeans. The waist would be too big or the hips would be too small and it was so annoying. Then I randomly found these on sale, tried them on and they fit perfectly. Probably because they're super stretchy and they're literally leggings, like they're actually jeggings. Yeah, I don't wear these a ton just because they kind of fall down a bit. So these are not my favorite jeans. But if you guys are looking for some affordable ones, then Hollister I would recommend if you fit in them. Next, I have another pair of Topshop jeans. Guys, Topshop is so amazing for jeans because they have small sizes and sizes that actually fit. But they have huge rips at the front and I've been looking for jeans like this for so long. All of my friends would literally have these where like you can see their whole knee and I just think that's so cute. They are really high-waisted, which is once again flattering for me. These are in a petite and which means they cut off at the perfect length, which is just... Topshop once again killed it. Lastly, I have some jeans from Princess Polly once again. These are the ones that I actually DIY'd. So if you guys want to see me painting these on, and I also DIY'd some of my shorts, you guys can click the I because I did like a whole clothing DIY video. These are not my favorite because the leg is very, very wide and it cuts off a little bit too short. I feel like I cut this myself though. I feel like these were too long and I cut them myself. I kind of just kept these because I can wear a belt with it and I really like the DIY that I did on it, but these are not my favorite. So now that I have a huge freaking pile of jeans to my right, I'm gonna end this video. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and let me know down below what other types of collection videos you guys want me to make. I can do like an accessories collection, I can do Brandy Melville, active wear, any type of collection, anything that you guys want, just let me know down below or any other type of fashion videos because I'm on a fashion kick right now. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye.